Hi everyone. One of the things that many of us enjoy doing when we get into the fall and winter months is reading, whether it's a novel or a self-help book or some sort of inspirational read. Reading is great all year round, but I love reading in the fall and winter as much as I love reading in the summer. So I picked up some books and I didn't plan on picking up these books from Walmart, but I did and I picked up quite a few. So I thought it would be interesting and informative to share with you some of the books that I purchased from Walmart. So I was initially in the book section of Walmart looking for a book for a children's birthday party and stumbled upon some great books for myself. So here we go. Let's get into these books. I have one, two, three, four, five books to share with you today. And I'm going to try not to move. Let me just take the books out so the bag doesn't you know, distract you or irritate you. Okay, so I have the books out on my lap and I'm just going to pick them up in no random order. I'm gonna fix my shirt as well. Okay, so the first book is Wake Up Happy by Michael Strahan. And you know, I'm on this path with making a choice to be happy and not just making a choice to be happy because I'm always I've always been a sort of naturally happy, optimistic person. Quick story, my mother said that when I was a baby, she would come to my crib to wake me up and when she'd arrive at my crib, I'd be awake smiling. <laughs> so I've always been, you know, a naturally glass is full kind of person. Um, but I, when I say that I've gotten into choosing happy, I'm referring to, yes, choosing happy in the midst of so many things going on, but also embracing those things that I love. And reading is one of those things that I love, love to read. But it's also one of those things that as I become a wife and busy mom that I've put to the side and I just didn't make time for as much. And so I wanted to have some great books to grab, some great books to have on hand to read. And the fact that this was about being happy and it was by Michael Strahan, I thought this could be a really good book. And it says, The Dream Big, Win Big Guide to Transforming Your Life. And I'm interested in what he has to say. So I picked this book up. And the next one, the title just jumped out at me because it's also a season that I'm in. I'm in a season now where I'm saying, okay, I want to pursue my purpose and I want to be fully aware of destiny. So this book is Destiny by T.D. Jakes. Step into your purpose. Destiny and purpose are two key words on my heart at this um, in this season of life. And so I was definitely interested in what he has to say. And I know T.D. Jakes has some great books out there. I may have one or two of his books already. And I was definitely interested in picking this up to find out what Mr. Jakes has to say about stepping into your purpose and your destiny. Really excited to read this book. Okay, now, I, my husband and I saw the movie War Room, and I saw this book, Fervent. And this one, I believe, was written by the actual, yeah, the actual star of the movie. That's her right there. And this is a woman's battle plan for serious specific and strategic prayer. I am a woman who prays. I am a woman who has seen answered prayer 100% of the time. I am more than a believer in prayer. Not only do I believe in prayer, but it is a way of life for me. And so when I saw this, it really jumped out. When I saw it, it just, it stood out because of the Battle Plan for Serious, Specific, and Strategic Prayer. And the movie was excellent. I could relate to the movie. I've seen that happen in my own life with different situations. And so I thought this was definitely something that I want to read. Okay, the next book is called One Nation by Dr. Ben Carson. What we can all do to save America's future. Uh, anytime I see a book by Dr. Carson, I purchase it. And I have, since we started homeschooling, um, 
I've purchased, I love to purchase books, autobiographies, and things like that to have on hand for my kids to read because there's so much to learn. And when I saw this, I oh, a new book by Dr. Carson. I need to add it to our collection. And I'm looking forward to reading this one as well. This is a number one New York Times bestseller. And the last book is a book by Steve Harvey. And this book is, um, it's the stickers on top of someone turn it to the side. Act like a success, think like a success. Now I know he has a book called um, Act Like a Woman, Think Like a Man. I didn't read that one, but this title is very similar to it. This is also a New York Times, number one New York Times bestseller. And I know um, Steve Harvey talks a lot about success. He talks a lot about um, your intentions and your mindset. And so when I saw this, I was interested to see what he had to say about acting and thinking like a success. So these are the books that I purchased from Walmart to read over the next few months. And I am more than happy to do reviews on books that I feel compelled to review. And I will leave links to these um, books in my description box. I have an Amazon store set up now. So if you would like to shop through my Amazon store, I would greatly appreciate it. Um, there is a commission that goes along with that that I will put a note about in the description box below. But I hope that you have enjoyed this haul. It was definitely a lot of fun to share it with you. And thank you so much for watching. Have a happy, happy, blessed day. Be happy, live full, love life. And I will see you in the next video.